another win uh, over there in Colorado, and uh, uh, basically uh, everything worked right for you guys to get that victory, and it sets it up nicely for the big one uh, on Saturday. This is kind of about uh, the success and kind of momentum going into Saturday. It was a big win for us, you know, the, dealing with the two uh, road games back to back. I think it was our two longest road games, and uh, I think we handled it well. And uh, when you got there, we handled business, and uh, you got back. Back here, we know what's at stake, and uh, we, need to, uh, we need to put the preparation in this week and uh, play well on Saturday. How are you guys? I mean, not only throughout the season, but even this week. I mean, a lot is on the line on Saturday. GNAC title, possible playoff, uh, you know, possibility. But also, this could be the last ever HSU football game. How are you guys, not for the seniors, juniors, sophomores, freshmen, how are you guys staying focused and trying to put everything else aside and stay focused? I think we're just uh, staying together, staying as one. We're not trying to think about or listen to all the noise that we can't control. We can control what we can control. So we can, we can control our preparation, our attitude and effort we put in during practice, and we control our performance on Saturday. Everything else is going to work itself out, and uh, hopefully uh, we manage to come out with a win. Yeah, you guys didn't get the win up there earlier against Central, but it's set up nicely. Final <laughs> game against Central, and you're at home. So pretty much it, it's set up there for you on Saturday. Yeah, this is, I don't think uh, you, you'll have it, you want it any other way. You know, we have it be our last game in the Weather Bowl on ESPN3, Senior Day. It just means uh, that much more, and uh, it's just a, it'd be a big one if we can, we, can, we can come out on top. Have you kind of thought about it the last three years from the sideline? You've watched seniors and kind of being honored before the game, a family, and that kind of thing. But have you thought about it all, what it's going to be like for you on Saturday? No, no yeah, I'm more focused on uh, the game. Uh, I mean, that's going to be a special moment, as it is for all of us. But uh, I just want to go out there and play. What did you learn from the, the Central game the last time? Um, and how, learning from it, what we attributed to now this Saturday, knowing that you guys have faced them once already and uh, learned what they're about? Well, we know they're a good team. You know, they, 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 scheme, they scheme well. So we got to come out there. You know, let's just know that we got to put in that much more time, film study, and preparation into the week going into Saturday because they got us last time. They got us good last time. And, and, we want to protect the weather ball. We don't want to lose the weather ball, so we just got to know. We got to be, be dialed in and focused every single day. How were they able to handle, I mean, not many teams able to handle Gardner, but what was their defense able to do? Were they loading the box? What were they doing? That yeah, they loaded the box a, a few times, but I think um, that day just, we, weren't, we weren't at our best, to be honest. Um, I think we were losing some, some battles, one-on-one -on -one battles, but, you know, you, you learn from it. and. Uh, we got them on turf, so we're, we're, we're a lot faster on turf. We, it was windy, it was cold down there, not making any excuses, but uh, you know, that, that all uh, are contributing factors to why it was such an ugly game for us offensively. Um, from day one, coming, making the decision to come into Humboldt State, earning the starting job as a freshman, and then to now, um, tell me, I mean, I'm sure you probably, you want to set your goals high, but is this what you expected to how your four-year career, how about that? Would yeah, go? yeah, you can't want to win championships, but uh, I think this one, this last game that means so much is, is how I wouldn't want to change anything because, you know, that's the last game means so much and to win in front of a home crowd and, and what's at stake outside of football. So I, I think that's, that's, that's what's really awesome. What's been the attitude or what's been the comments from other students on campus or just everybody just – Knowing it's uh, the final week of the regular season for you guys. Yeah, a lot of good lucks, and uh, you know they're excited for us. They they want to come out and support support us, and uh, they're excited as everyone should be in the community because of the magnitude of the game. Um, you guys had two straight home games, so the two straight road games. How big was it for you guys just to keep that momentum going on the road, take care of business against two teams that obviously you guys proved to be better than. And then you know, basically, be at your best for for such a big game. So oh, it's huge! Online. It's huge to carry that. It's huge, you know, to carry the momentum week in and week out. And we just look forward to continuing to uh, build off that and perform well on Saturday. How would you say uh, you guys are different from the first time you played Central up there to, to where you guys are now? Um, I think we're more mature as a team. You know, we got down early, 
I was kind of like freaked out. And, uh, uh, now I think we've been there. You know it's you know what it's like. So I think uh, as a team we we matured and we learned from those mistakes that we made down in the uh, central. Um, Coach Smith was talking a couple minutes ago just about how accomplished this senior class is, and obviously you're a huge part of that. But to be one of the 24 that has meant so much to this program, you know, getting into a conference title in the playoffs two years ago, to obviously this year playing for another conference title. I mean, what's it been like you knowing that you've got so many accomplished guys around you, and then you're, you know, you're one of the main guys as well? I mean, it's a lot. You know, it's, 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 I think it's, 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 you know, it's, it's a privilege to play with all the seniors and everyone else on this team. And just it shows the hard work that we've put in throughout our career to get us where we're at right now. And I think that's what it really, really shows. Um, one of those seniors, obviously you know pretty well in Chase. This wasn't supposed to be his senior year. Last year it was supposed to be. Um, what has it meant to you, knowing that you guys were you know so close in high school and obviously you know, close now, to, to finish out this year with him, finish out your, your senior year with him and, and accomplish everything you have It feels good. You know, it's, it's really it was awesome having him. I get like it, like it always is, but uh, just having that dynamic player outside that you can get the ball to on a quick little double or a quick little hitch, and he could uh, turn in his 75 yards like he did last week. But I think it's it's, it's we're really blessed to have him this year, and I think uh, I don't think this team will be what it is without him. Coach mentioned another wide ups come back, John Todd. I'm sure you're yeah. pretty happy about yeah. that. But uh, when John Todd is at full go, what does he add to this offense? A lot, a lot. He has a deep threat. You know, his speed can't be matched. You know, and uh, we take a lot of one of those shots with him. But uh, experience, uh, that, that experience that I have with him, and that chemistry that we have, you know, that, that we're extremely comfortable with one another. We know what each other wants. You know, I know, I know what he's looking for against this coverage, against this route, and he knows where I'm gonna put the ball. So I think that that opens up the offense a little bit more. And obviously, you guys want your season to go beyond this week, but. Uh, the senior group that has accomplished so much. What do you think kind of the lasting legacy for this for this group will be? Junior championship, for sure. We want to get that get that that one's a uh, that one's a big one, one of the only one big ones and uh, you know if we kept we kept to get in the playoffs and, and we'll take it we we'll take it day by day, week by week and hopefully we could uh leave this uh, leave our legacy in the positive you know Awesome. Thank you. Thank you.